to another tutorial from VideoEditingSoftwareGuide.com. Today we're going to do a review of Pinnacle Studio 14 Ultimate Collection HD. Now, this software is not for beginners. It's an intermediate software package that has a lot of great effects, transitions, has a lot of great functionality to make your videos truly spectacular. So let's go ahead and get started. So when you first open up the uh, software, it's going to take you to the videos on your computer. So a great thing about that is it takes you right to where your videos are at if you've stored them there. Uh, if you have folders in there, it'll have folders that show or you can go directly to the files if you don't have the files in any particular folders. So if you want to go ahead and add something to your timeline, you just go ahead and grab the frame and you bring it down where you want it to be. So one of the great things about this is that when you click on a particular frame or a file, you can go ahead and play it in the preview pane to see what it looks like when it plays. So that's a pretty nifty feature. If you have some files in there that look kind of similar, say you did a lot of takes of the same thing back to back, then you can go ahead and play them and get a preview of what they look like. So the other thing that you can do is you can have uh, transitions added to your film. So as you can see, there are a lot of transitions here. So these are the 3D transitions, but you can actually go to many different types of transitions. Um, Studio uh, 14 has a lot of transitions that it comes with if you get the ultimate collection. And you can also go to the Pinnacle website and purchase different ones that you can add to it. Now, once again, when you go to the different um, transitions and you click on them, you get a preview of what they look like in a preview plane. So you can see or get an idea of what they look like when you add them to your video. Next thing I want to show you is a little bit about the montage themes. Um, Pinnacle Studio 14 Ultimate Collection HD has some montage themes which are actually some great ways to do some intros or outros to your video. Um, they actually have a, a whole lot of different montages that you can use from extremes to sports to seasons. Um, and there are you know, just a huge amount of those that you can utilize. And um, I do have a demo of the montage themes on our uh, YouTube site and also available on um, videoeditingsoftwareguide.com if you want to see some of those demos. Um, so, next thing we want to talk about here is the uh, text. So, there are a lot of different text effects that you can have as well. And a lot of these different titles uh, are motion titles. So, you can actually have some type of uh, motion of the words going across the screen or another effect in the background that you might want to see going on with the title as well. Here's an example of some of the motion titles that you get here. Some pretty cool little effects that you can add to your videos if you need to or if you'd like to. So that just gives you an idea of some of the different titles that you can do. So you can also make great slideshows with Pinnacle. So if you were making a slideshow for something, you can add the photos, drop them down in the timeline, add some music or sound effects to your video. It's all pretty cool stuff. Um, of course, you also have the ability to add menus, uh, DVD menus, chapters, titles, buttons, so that if you're going to make a Blu-ray disc or DVD, you have the functionality to go to wherever you'd like to on your DVD. It's really easy to utilize. One of the things that um, really stand out about this software is the effects that you get to use and create. So if you double click on one of the um, the video clips in your timeline you can actually get this menu here on the left where you can um, change the duration of the clip you can cut it trim it here you can add text to it you can do an overlay or you can make a full screen motion title of your own that you want to make um, you can go ahead and create a disk menu here over the video clip you can grab frames and create pictures 
from the clip if you like. All you got to do is play it, click the grab, and you grab that clip, and now it's a, a picture. Um, you can also go ahead and make a music video out of any inform any video clips that you have here. Um, you can go to do picture in picture. You can scale it to where you put it wherever on the screen. It has some presets here that you can use for that. You can go to the chroma key here and if you have a green screen, blue screen, or any of these colors really, uh, you can do a chroma key or a, a luma key if you wish to do that. Effects in Pinnacle Studio are fantastic. Um, there are so many of them to choose from that you probably wouldn't need to use them all. But let's just go ahead and get rid of that one. Click on add new effect. And as you can see, you've got some things here on the side. So if I want to do dream glow, I click on it. You see how it changed a little bit there. If I want to do, um, let's see here, emboss. You click on that and you get to get a look at how it looks when it gets embossed. Um, let's see. You can do watercolor, fractal clouds, fire, a tunnel, a fire, a hall of mirrors. So there are too many to even go through right now. But uh, there are a lot of great effects that just come with it automatically that you can put in there. And then you can also purchase more, as I stated before, at the um, Pinnacle website. So, <coughs> some of the great software that comes with it is you have Red Giant Null, where you can actually do lights. Um, if you click on it, as you can see, it added a little lens flare there. But what you can do is you can move it across the screen. You can have it move in different directions. You can do anything. With that. Um, the tune it, as you can see, it added a bit of a cartoon effect to it. So you can utilize that. 3D stroke. You see the circle that comes here. Well, basically what it does is it just allows you to add different types of um, effects to it. Where you might have um, your colors going across the screen. You can have uh, streams of uh, different colors going in different directions it adds a lot of different uh, nice functions to it um, Red Giant Particular is a particle effect so it has some pre presets here that you can go ahead and use so if you want to add some different types of effects to it there's many different things that you can do And then you also have Trap Code Shine, where you can have uh, lights go from behind things to in front of things, across the screen, um, diagonally. You can do a lot of different things with this software. And um, you'll see some of the demos that shows the functionality of these things on our YouTube page and also at our website, videoeditingsoftwareguide.com. So, that's it. That's our review of Pinnacle Studio Ultimate Collection HD. We hope you've uh, learned a little something today. And for any tips, techniques, any questions that you have on this software, please go to videoeditingsoftwareguide.com. Click on the Contact Us button on the left. Send us an email. We'll be happy to help you out. Or go to our YouTube page. That's VIGOR2001. And Send us a message there, and we'll be happy to go ahead and help you out. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again next time.